Okay, see, in your electrostatics, you will uh, study a discrete charge, which is a charge, a single charge, experiencing force, superposition, uh, you calculate forces due to Coulomb's law. And as you progress, you will study about electric field and so on, and electric potential, uh, potential energy. Then you come to the dipole, you know, which is two equal and opposite charges separated by a small distance. Interesting uh, things happen in the electric dipole. There is a, you know, dipole experiences a torque. Uh, dipole has its own electric field on the axis and, uh, you know, perpendicular uh, plane, equatorial plane, etc., etc. One of the, you know, third topic which is studied in electrostatics is about, you know, a system of continuous charges. Now, I will talk about continuous charges, but you must understand continuous charges is different from discrete and dipole charges. Thank you.